Uh, where do you picture Bon Jovi in five years? Probably making another record. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I don't see why not. Uh, this tour is uh, already off to a monumentous start, as uh, and the, the reception that the album has received has been fantastic. So, like I said, as long as we're friends, I don't see why five years. That's short. That's nothing. That's that's next week. Five years is a blink of an eye. Uh, 10, 15, 20 years. Then I start to think about, whoa. You know, I saw the Stones at 12-12. The Stones have always been the bar to me. That that's The day that they quit, at least I'll know where the end zone is. <laughs> <laughs> Until then, there is, no, there is no ending, right? Because McCartney and the Stones and the, the Who, they're all still working uh, and doing it really well at a, in a style in which they had grown accustomed. And so in turn, I'd always said that about us. And, uh, and yet when I saw the Stones the night after 12-12, I, I mean, it would take this only the Stones for me to go to a show after that night, and I did. And I sat there, my, you know, my jaw down in my knee and just go, oh my God, they're just still awesome. So as, if you can do it in, in that manner, uh, in the style of which I've grown accustomed, then there is no end zone, you know, until Jack and Richards tell us. <laughs> you know, just keep doing it.